In this video, we're going to explore the five different ways you can conduct a search in the Vesta Plus application. Form, Radius, Layers, Visible Map, and Shapes. Method 1. Form Search. A form search is conducted by adding criteria to the form in the listing search page. Let's say we want to search for active, single-family listings in West Hollywood. On our form, we select active and single family. We can set a price range by clicking on the dollar sign. We can even ask for listings that include a fireplace. As you can see, there is no submit button. The map applies your results automatically. Method two, radius search. Radius search is best for when you have an address in mind. We are dropped right into the input field where we enter the distance we'd like our radius to extend from. I'll put in 0.25 miles. The system draws a circular shape with a radius of 0.25 miles from its center point. So the shape gets drawn and all the listings that meet my form criteria are presented inside it. Method three, layers. Let's imagine you have a client that has two kids and wants to send them to the Laurel Elementary School in West Hollywood. Let me show you how easy that is using layer search. I put West Hollywood in my criteria for MLS area and immediately see the map get populated. I'm seeing clusters, which means I need to narrow down my search by adding more filters. But first, let me go over to the layers palette because that's going to help me identify the school boundary for Laurel Elementary. In the drop-down for the Layers palette, I find Primary School and select it. With all my primary school boundaries visible, it's easy for me to see where the Laurel Elementary School boundaries are. So I will tap on the Laurel Elementary School section, and come to think of it, I remember my clients being interested in nearby Hancock Park and the Melrose areas as well, so I will include those areas. It's easy to tell at a glance that there are way more options in Laurel and Rosewood than in Hancock Park. But either way, I have to filter down these results. So I'm going to add their criteria, active and single family residents. This leaves us 29 great listings to present to our client that we found using the layer search feature. Method four, visible map. Search visible map is awesome if you're exploring. In this example, I'm looking for homes that are active, single family, between 900,000 and 150 million, with a minimum of two beds and two baths. But my client is open to living in quite a few different cities. Notice I have not entered an area, city, or zip. Instead, I have search visible map activated. So the map populates with listings as I drag it. By contrast, if I turn it off, see how the map zooms out since I don't have any area city, or zip defined. Last but not least, method five, shapes. Shapes are a great way to zoom into a map region. For example, if you farm an area that's not strictly determined by city, zip, MLS area, etc., you have the option of drawing a square, circle, or polygon. And if you want to click on the pencil icon, there is also a free draw tool that allows you to draw any shape you want. Our suggestion is to draw the shape, then enter your criteria. And those are five great ways to search using Vesta Plus. For more details on the features shown in this video, please feel free to chat with us, call us, or visit our new Vesta Plus help section. Thanks for watching.